When someone says insurance dispute, many people picture a policyholder who's upset with the insurance company. However, sometimes the insurance company is the aggrieved party. In this lesson, we'll explore the types of claims an insurer might pursue to enforce its policy rights. Under the insurance policy, the policyholder's primary duty is to pay premiums. If a policyholder breaches this duty, the insurer may decline to issue a policy, deny a claim, or rescind an existing policy. If an insurer rescinds a policy, it means undoing the contractual agreement completely, which typically requires the insurer to return any prior premium payments to the policyholder. A policyholder's other policy duties may include providing timely notice to the insurer of changes to insured property or losses. In addition, for losses, policies typically require policyholders to cooperate with the claims process. If a policyholder breaches one of these policy duties, the insurer may be able to deny the loss claim but likely won't be able to rescind the entire policy. A policyholder also has a duty to provide accurate information in both the policy application and during a claim. If the policyholder provides inaccurate information, even accidentally, the insurer might be misled into taking actions that it wouldn't have taken if it had accurate information, which undermines the entire insurance relationship. However, not every inaccurate detail matters. Typically, an insurance company has a claim for misinformation only if the misinformation is material and the insurer reasonably relied on it. Misinformation is material if knowing the truth would have caused the insurer to take a different action, like not paying a claim or issuing a policy on different terms. An insurer reasonably relied on material misinformation if the insurer's different act would have been reasonable under the circumstances.